Good morning. Welcome to this portion of the vlog where we freeze in our car. We spend about 10 minutes sitting out here, letting the car warm up, letting her defrost. Living in a place where your face is cold whenever you go outside is not great, but the summers are nice. Welcome to my vlog. It is another teacher day in my life. I've been trying to do these for like 15 days. Honestly, I start it, I do this little intro, and then I get to school and I just get busy and it doesn't happen. So maybe today it'll happen, or maybe today I'll just get deleted like every other day that I've done. Guys, it's a lunch where I actually like remember to film something amazing. So I'm finishing up my lunch. Today was mini corn dogs. We have the little cinnamon apples, which are like one of my favorite things. And usually when you have the little containers like this, it's like canned vegetables that I normally don't like. It's just been like a typical day. I was in the second grade room helping them make some Valentine's Day boxes instead of doing services with my students because I didn't want her to miss making Valentine's Day boxes with her class. So I just went in there and did it with her, which was super fun. A kid gave me a sticker. A lot of like the normal curriculums with my younger kids. Um, we finished our reading mastery lesson early, which we're on the box book. So then we started doing a guided drawing and it is this Valentine's Day kitten. But obviously we didn't finish because we just ran out of time. Normally our reading mastery lessons take like exactly a half hour, which is perfect because that's the slot that I have those kids for. And then they go to lunch and I go to lunch and then I sit on and do my virtual meeting over at lunch while eating with one of my students. And today we were watching a Scooby-Doo Valentine's Day episode because she's obsessed with Scooby-Doo. Um, but yeah, today we just had a little extra time so we did this guided drawing because they both really like cats and I like cats too. So I have nine minutes until my next virtual student clean up my area and then do my attendance because mostly by now I've realized that I didn't do my attendance yesterday but today I actually did my attendance so congrats to me. So incredibly shocking, um, we went right from school to Walmart because I realized I didn't know what I wanted to eat and I decided I'm going to do a math activity tomorrow that you need conversation cards so just me and my last minute planning life. They don't have perforations, you have to cut them, which is fine, but when you've got a pile of Valentines, the last thing you wanna be doing is cutting things apart. I'm also going to go through their pencil boxes and get rid of the old pencils, throw them away because germs, and then replace them all with Valentine's Day pencils. Okay, so basically my kids are getting this clear bag. I've washed my hands, we're clean. Um, I should do my birthday first. first. Mr. I Love Zelda, he's getting a pencil. He's getting a Snickers, an M&M airplane, a fun dish, a lifesaver sucker, an airhead. He's not interested in cars. He's not an eraser kind of kid. I did a candy activity with students today. He didn't do that with me, obviously, because he's working, so I gave him a candy heart. And that's one student's bag's done. Now to repeat it like 15 times. like five o'clock time to go home valentine's day bags are done i am going to keep the candy for tomorrow because one of my students i know doesn't have valentine's so sad makes my heart hurt but that's why i spoiled him so much but i have a couple boxes of like the card style he can choose from that he can pass out to his friend and then um leftover candy Reds is there. I will let him uh, staple to his Valentine card as well. And any leftovers, I will either eat or throw it in our lovely candy bucket. And this is a unicorn wrapped in unicorn wrapping paper. It's uh, really great. Great wrapping. This is my favorite virtual student. She comes all the time. She sees me every day. We have a great time together. I just adore her. She's a great kid. And I saw this unicorn I just had to get it for her. And because she's virtual, nobody else is going to know that she got it. So I don't feel guilty in getting one student such an extravagant gift compared to the others. Because 
nobody's gonna know because she's virtual so yeah i need to go home i'm just gonna do another video tomorrow of my valentine's day shenanigans who knows uh and i'm virtual teaching still in the afternoon while everyone else is doing their valentine's day party so it just kind of depends what happens so i'm gonna end this video right here thank you guys so much for watching i'll catch you guys tomorrow in my next video <laughs>